Or, I mean, the flyers are relevant right now. Yeah, we could double block. Is that bad? I don't think that's terrible. The, I mean, this is what could, like, turn the game in his favor. What is the opponent doing, says Chubby? So, yes. You should still be on always no, always yield, man. I thought I set you. Silvergill. Yeah, I like the double block. Alright, so are we just win. Right? I guess I could be sneaky with my sower. But sowering here lets us get in with everybody but Prodigy profitably. Like, it gets rid of the spell skite. Let me borrow that. God, this one of sower is so sweet. I, not that I would run two. I'm just saying it's won us a lot of the creature matchups. Like, sower is just so gross. Yeah, just take a skite. Smash everything except Prodigy. Having a Skite on our side will be sweet. Yeah. Actually, I could just... Yeah, I mean, I, I like just jamming the Flyers. Sower Smash. Oh my god. This Sower is just so sweet. I know it's a one of, but we can tutor for it. But it's so... Just... There's so many matchups, it's just one for us. Like, we've stolen... Earlier, we stole a Siege Rhino with this, remember? Sower lets our... Yeah, he's, he's done. Wizards! We took one! We took game one against Affinity! Granted, I think he made some mistakes. Uh, I'm not saying our opponent played perfect. Uh, that's not what I'm saying at all. Um, negative on that, guys. Is Roast terrible? Roast deals with Spell Skite, and he's running Skites, and that turns off my bolts. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying that I'm aware... That, uh, I don't think the moons were that great. I mean, it was okay. It turned off the man land, which was relevant. Couldn't we just still just run one Magus, a tutorable moon? Do we need the combo against this deck, says Turkish? That's a good point. I may not need the combo. We may just cut Glen Sage combo and just run Prodigies. Maybe we're happy trading, uh, trading our dudes. The Vendillion click was great, but I don't know if it's right. Challenge, flash in all of your creatures. Lurking about. Science rules. Skite's good to block with. Yeah, Skite's a good blocker. Yeah, this Wizard Tribal is so much fun, David Oso. Overmatch says Glenn is really good, though. Yeah, why have we gone to just a one of a fur? That's probably wrong, actually. Glenn's really good in the matchup. Helps against their flyers. I mean, we don't have time to do stuff with Sage. Why don't we cut one Sage? Well played game, Sis Gallagher. Oh, it was it was it was interesting for sure. Maybe I don't have time to sit back on the adepts and draw. Belgarian! Science rules. That was fun. I mean, can we cut a land? Like caverns are relevant in this matchup. No, cutting lands has hurt us before. Game what says bounce master. Telemokos, thanks for the host. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Um. I mean, Vidilia Click was interesting there. I don't know if it's necessarily good. You'd go for the Kira and go to the skies. Okay, so Kira. Can't go to 22 land. Okay. I don't know if we really have time to Silvergill. Let's just sit back and cantrip. They're nice, though. But maybe this is a matchup where we just have to have it. I'm not underestimating him. Maybe even cut one master, because once we're ready for it, we'll tutor for it. Although slamming it's nice, but we brought in a little more move, a little more intera interaction in a Hercules recall. That's probably wrong, but we'll see. We can go to two masters. We can. It's still as if we have four copies due to the wizard cycle. Trim a couple adepts. We can't keep this. I mean, it's got our sideboard cards, that's great and all, but if this is a land, this is a land, this is still a keepable hand. Mole six. Well, we'll have to play game three, probably. That's too bad. Ooh, never mind. There's an Aether Vial. So the deck is designed around wizard cycling, says Raptor. Yes, it is designed around wizard cycles. Yes. 
I'm not kidding. That's what it's designed around. I guess like lead bluff? I don't know. I mean like maybe you still just want to crack that. Go. I'd like to see one more draw before I know what I'm doing with the Scalding Tarn. We, do, we did bring in Magus to the moon. Sure. Another Either Vial? Okay. Second Vial, we don't mind. Second, because we like it on... We like a Vial on one, and we like a Vial on two. It might be correct for me to just jam Prodigy. No. You play Tarn, and you play Vial. Do you really want Shattering Spree over Vandal? Uh, we talked about that, Rogue. Uh, a lot of that actually has to do with the fact that there's Eldrazi lists running Chalice for one. Uh, otherwise, I still like Vandal. Uh, Rogue, that's a great question. If there wasn't Chalice being played, I mean, it's hilarious. I never thought we'd see Chalice in Modern. It's kind of exciting, actually. Do you guys like the tempo play of Harbinger on the, on the Ravager? And then try to counter it when it comes back down? We can't set that up just yet. I'm talking about the future. Future. Whoa, Magic Online. I actually didn't click that. Okay. I mean, my mouse is over it. Maybe it thought I clicked. It's fine. So we're going to go up on these trains. Say yes, say yes. I kind of like just holding up the instant speed counter or the instant speed harbinger. There's the wizard cycler. So we can find the master or whatever we need. Sower would be cool too. Prefer Vandal, Chalice is kind of dropping down in playability. I kept saying Chalice is good. Yeah, I mean, you can just do the Harbinger now. Uh, and then he probably spends the next turn Ravaging. I kind of want to set up Harbinge and then Prodigy. I got an idea. We'll end step the Ravager with the Harbinger, and then we can establish Prodigy counter for the Ravager to come back. Cheese, another Ravager? Alright. Um, shoot. There's no guarantee that I'm getting another land drop, by the way. Um, okay. Shoot, I can't really flash in the Prodigy and sacrifice it. That's not worth just yet. What about this crazy cockamamie play? What if I just flash in the... E We're going to lose this if I don't do something. What if I flash... And there's no guarantee I'm getting another land drop. What if I flash in... Because we, we can't wizard cycle. What if I flash this guy in? And I block on the Mem Knight... And then he's like, uh, what do I sacrifice? There's no good sacrifices except for moving it to the Ravager. And then it's more of a blowout when I try to Harbinge. I'm not even kidding. This might be finally time for us to use the Ether Mage for its other function, which is blocks. Or returning, like, a Muta Vault to somebody's hand. Hold up Ether Mage to bounce the Sliver. Rasa Sensei, you can bounce Muta Vaults with this. Just block the Mem Knight. Alright. Yeah, I don't hate it. We're finally using it for its other mode. It's other mode is blocking. It's here mainly for the wizard cycling, like 90, 99% of the time we've used it, but if we're up against aggro, this is a decent block here. The Memnite block is kind of awkward for the opponent. Actually, was I supposed to Harbinge then? I was supposed to Harbinge then too and block. Fudge. I just realized it. Too late. No, because then he wouldn't, he'd sack it to the other Ravager. I mean, if I wanted to prevent the damage, he can't replay Ravager. I can still Harbinge. I can still Harbinge, and then when he tries to recast the Ravager, will Prodigy sacrificing the Ether Mage? Let's not take any damage here. Say yes. Let's let's put in the Harbinger. Let's Harbinge the Rav. Yes. Yeah. Reverse. This actually this this am particular Ambush Viper blocks better than normal Ambush Viper. Say yes, and say yes. We're not moving this one up anymore. Um, we drew a roast. That's fantastic. That makes everything so much easier. Hang on, though. Hang on, though. Hang on, though. That's It's probably wrong for me to just jam. He could top deck plating, and that's worth countering. Why don't we swing? This is looking great for us. I was worried that we... We mulled a five. This is a mulligan to five, gentlemen. That's gross. Ambush Squire. This was pure sweetness using the... I mean, we will sacrifice it to the Prodigy. Let's let's pass back. We don't have to roast yet. We can counter whatever he plays if it's important. If it's not, we'll maybe consider doing something else. We probably still flash this in the end step. Plating will suck here. He has one artifact. 
Just slam the roast. Hold up. He's casting something. Hang on. I mean, I, I just like countering the Ravager when it comes back down, guys. Good job, Ether Mage. Wow, that Ether Mage on its other function was actually really solid. To be fair, opponent plays suboptimal, kept questionable hands both times. Isn't that just better? I mean, I almost would just block the Ravager. No, we're roasting it next turn, aren't we? So this one's going to be always no, always yield. This one we're going up one more time. Prevents her. Deck is looking great right now. I'm not saying that this deck is tier 1. I'm just saying this is so much fun. I have had so much fun with this deck. I hope you guys have too. And we're, 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 we are playing you know, tier, against tiered decks. I think a lot of our advantage is the fact that they don't really know what's going on. This wizard deck. It's got combos too. If you're just tuning in, we have a combo. Uh, Sage, Glen. So Sage, Archmage, and then you can throw in a Prodigy and it's blue blue counterspell for pretty much anything. Opponent's first hand game one was fine, says XSV. Good play now to roast and swing. Yeah, Wizards is actually really solid right now. It might be a metagame thing. You can recast that. That doesn't excite me. I mean, I don't hate it. I don't hate a Vencer tempo play though. If he's doing nothing. Just a one of Vencer, but it's powerful when we do it. So these are going to both be always no, always yield. Galabunka! Science rules. We built this here, guys. All right, Delta, not a great draw, but it does give me double counter. If we need to pitch Harbinger and Venser. Um, I don't think that we do, but... In the interest of diversity, Videlk and Aether Mage is now banned from Modern. Were you supposed to block Ravager instead of Memnite, says Turkish? Are you sure? Jamming for six, make him pay two for Scourge seems good. We may not recast it. Okay. I don't have to swing with the Aether Mage or Prodigy. Champion. That seems worth countering. Shamar says, Dan dang son, you almost have 300 viewers at the top. Magic for stream partnership, here we come. Oh, thanks, guys. I, I tried to pay attention to it. Um, I'm, I'm happy even just with Transcos. Let's just swing Venser. This deck is super sweet. I hope you guys uh, I hope you guys play it. And if you do, please, please let people know where you found it. We brewed it here together on the channel. I don't take full credit for the decks ever. You guys certainly help me with my play and our and the brewing. We brew together. We're a team. We're a team here, guys. Seriously, this deck wouldn't be half as sweet if I hadn't brought it before you guys. And you're like, well, why don't you try this, Sean? Why don't you try that? Like, why don't you try some main deck roast? Well, maybe maybe we should run like a sower. That'd be really cool. And like like all these little things just come together. That's fine. He's at one though. He's at one. Couldn't I like spend half an Archmage to counter this? Doesn't it doesn't seem bad. Isn't this deck sweet? It's only sweet because you guys help me. This just in any deck that deck that can beat Eldrazi is now banned. Save it for the surprise. Zach says, I really want to play this. It's really fun. I, 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 like, we did a 24 hour stream just because I enjoyed the deck so much. We just took down a. <laughs> Granted, he, he wasn't the best affinity player, but we're 2 0 with Wizards. Let's see if we can 4 1 again or, or go all the way. 306 viewers online versus Brew. I like these odds. Oh, 306 viewers online plus me plus one poor guy on Affinity. I like these odds. Poor guy. This deck is amazing. Now, XXV, you're not wrong. I feel like my play has improved a lot just because you guys, um, just, just playing with you guys, like streaming. I think it's improved my play a lot. And I understand that I, 